Welcome back, everybody. Lightning ESL Public Speaking Part 16, Audience Analysis. Audience Analysis? Yeah, Audience Analysis. If you understand Audience Analysis, you will know 90% of your audience will love you. They will grasp every motion, every movement, every word you say. Audience Analysis. Remember certain categories within Audience Analysis. First, age. Attitudes about your topic. Everybody thinks differently depending on their age. A 20-year-old will think differently than a 50-year-old about your topic. That's right. They have certain beliefs and strategies and attitudes about your topic depending on your age. If everybody's the same age as you, you understand how they think. But if you're 30 years older or 30 years younger, whatever it is, you have to adapt. Age makes a big difference how people think about your topic of speech. Next. Sex. Are the audience members mostly female? Are they all male? I'm a male. So if I'm talking to all female audience, I have to think differently, don't I? If I'm female, talking to all male audience, I have to adapt, don't I? If you have a mixture of both, you're fine. But remember, every audience is different. There's no guarantee, is there? No. Next, humor. Female humor is different than male humor. That's right. If I'm a male talking to a total female audience, I have to be careful what I say and how I say it. If I'm a female talking to all male audience, it's the same thing. You have to be careful about humor, don't you? We react differently to certain types of humor. All right? Next, persuasion. Men want exact detail, whereas women want emotional stories and situations. That's right. We like facts and detail most of the time. Women want emotion, situations, stories, things like that. If you can blend that into your topic, they love you. Next, educational background. Are you all highly educated with PhDs and masters, or just came out of high school, or university, or college? If you understand this as part of audience analysis, you'll be very, very good at understanding it. They will grasp what you're trying to say and they'll stick with you the entire speech. Next, cultural background. That's right, diverse beliefs and traditions. I think differently in North America, whereas you think differently in your country. You have to recognize that, understand how they think, how they feel about certain customs and traditions as part of your speech goes along. You have to be aware of that. And finally about this audience analysis is also, of course, the location, where it is, major hall, small hall, banquet room, meeting room, whatever, big, small, how are the acoustics, how are the listening skills, how is the sound coming through, all right? Also, time of day, is it morning, is it afternoons and night, is it weekends, is it a holiday weekend, and so on. This is all part of audience analysis. I can't stress this enough, this is very, very important to understand. Once you understand audience analysis, you understand 90% of any speech doesn't matter if the speech is five minutes, five hours. If you understand the audience, how they think, how they act, and why they do, you'll do very, very well in public speaking. You will, because you understand how they think in front of you before you open your mouth. You don't always have time, do you, to analyze your audience. You might have 30 seconds, just like I've done many times. Brian, go speak, just like that. Within 30 seconds, you have to be so observant. If you have hours ahead of time or days ahead of time, that's a huge bonus. All right? Audience analysis, very, very important. Till next time, this is Lightning ESL, part 16, audience analysis. Till next time, bye-bye.